So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today guys I showcase you an incredible weapon, I mean check that out, it looks like a, like a, a dragonfly wing, well it kind of is, but it's, it is one of the most OP weapons in this game right now, it looks absolutely incredible, it scales off intelligence, it isn't a staff, it's amazing guys, today we get into it all. How's it going people? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leave a like, it really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so the wing of Estelle. Mine's a plus nine. I was going to put a 10 into it, but you know what I just did guys? I not long respect. I'm going with a faith build. So I did have actually a massive amount in intelligence, but now I've gone faith. So yeah, my intelligence has dropped. So I've had to actually put on a couple of things just to kind of boost this up to showcase to you guys how good it can be. But I mean, it's still, it's nothing compared to what it can it's nothing compared to what this can be guys it can be utterly brutal i've seen a few clips guys of people just taking out like the fire giant i think mill gaming posted a video on twitter destroying the fire giant with this thing now obviously it will like i said require actually did we check out what it, yeah so it, it requires seven in strength 17 in dexterity and 20 in intelligence so yeah not not a bad weapon guys now attacks you have of the uh special attack the special ability is this beautiful looking thing right here see it's spawning some exploding stars amazing now the heavy attack is actually got two heavy attacks which shoots at a projectile that actually don't use no focus points which is pretty cool but if you hold the heavy attack that does two uh projectiles don't use any focus points looking pretty amazing and the light attack is actually pretty good quite light quite quick not bad whatsoever guys the weapon is amazing the weapon is amazing now we're gonna go to this i normally go to this giant here who's a little heftier than the one at the storm gate so yeah he can take a bit more damage i just want to see what it does to him and if it does good damage to him i'm gonna go to the giants in the snow because they can take some serious damage but hey like i said my intelligence was i mean look at that look at that my intelligence was I think about 75 before this weapon would have been so much better <laughs> so much better you know what we do that goes too easy we're gonna go up here we're gonna go up here guys we're gonna go up here now there's a couple right by here the big old monster marbles yeah we're gonna see what it does to them and now i'm gonna showcase you exactly how you get this thing now there is a bit of a grind to get this weapon because you will have to go one of either two ways uh, but both ways are kind of a grind but hey, I'll explain all in a second. Now, where's that big dude? Where is he over here somewhere? Is he not? He's probably going to clap me because, like I said, my intelligence is so... Well, it's not It's not low. My intelligence ain't low, but I'm just not built for an intelligence build. I'm just, I'm just not for it. There's a guy watching me. I'm just going to clap him. I'm just trying to get behind him. See, see what happens. See what happens with this guy. I'm going to make myself look a fool now. saying this is one of the best weapons. It is. I can tell already because the other guy's... Uh, like that other giant I just killed. Yeah. This is ridiculous. Yeah, this is ridiculous, people. <laughs> Man, I need to go back into intelligence now. <laughs> oh. Yeah, this thing's a this thing's a beast. It's a beast. Should we go quickly see what it does to a dragon? Let's go and see what it does to a dragon. Let's quickly, quickly go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And there's a couple around here. Yeah, okay, we're just gonna go and just gonna go and destroy a couple of dragons. We like to see what this weapon's like. We like I ain't got many bosses left to fight. I need to go back into New Game Plus. Well, I need to go into New Game Plus. It's just I'm, I wanna find all kinds of shit before I start New Game Plus. I, I don't, I'm not looking forward to opening up all those graces again. I just really ain't. Ha ha, I see you, dragon. I see you, dragon. I went to the wrong point, guys, so I'll cut the video. But I see you. Can I go around this way? Can I go around this way? Now, with my faith build, I can one hit this guy with my thingies, but I won't see what this does. But this end obviously won't be as good as my faith build. Football, it mounts, man. It does melt so bad jeez man yeah ha 
I hate I need to I need to level up. I need to go and farm runes so I can level up. That's what I need to do. Instead of respecting. The problem is with me. I'm at 11 hour runes. It costs so many runes to level up. I keep dying before I get a chance to level up. Okay, so where do you get this? Well, this is obtained, guys. From down here, you need to get to the Ensor River main. So you need to progress this way. And it's around here. I think it's around here actually, but it don't matter either way. You, he, you have to get to this, this point here. And the one way you can get to this point is via doing Rani's quest line, which starts up here. So you need to clear out Carrier Manor, uh, kill Loretta, come to um, Rani's Rise here, start the quest. Eventually, guys, uh, throughout that quest, you'll come to this tower here, which teleports you directly to this area here. You can just run down. But there is another way. The other way, guys, is to defeat Radan there. That quest line starts here. So come here, come to Red Bank Castle, kill Radan, which is here. That opens up this, well, from this grace here. Nocron City. So you need to come here, make your way down to Nocron City. This way you'd have to come to and defeat the Mimic Tier boss. We'd have to come and I believe it's somewhere around here. There's twin gargoyles. You have to kill them. At the end of their room there's a tomb. That tomb guys takes you to the deep root depths. Then guys you need to come all the way here and there's a tomb there which takes you to right up here. Now I've got actual videos, uh, I have a video link below, it's 13 secret paths, uh, it showcases both of these, uh, so if you want to do either one, I'd probably say Ran is easier because the twin gargoyles for lower levels, they're a pain in the ass, they're a pain in the ass, uh, as well as, as well as your darn can be a pain in the ass as well, so yeah, I'll link it down below guys, and then, when we, you actually get to here, this is a path you need to take, now, I do want to say credit to my pal Eclipse, uh, for bringing this to my attention, that's you already been down this area. I'd already, well, there's not a boss you have to defeat, but there's like a boss in the way you can run around him. But I killed the boss, I looked around this whole area, I didn't find this, but yeah. End South River Man. So, you just want to come this way, guys, ignore all the ads. You can't pull out your horse, you have to run, you have to run, guys. But yeah, now there will be a few boss, a few big area enemies here that uh, you can run past or take out. I've taken them out. I can't remember if I got anything special from them, but hey, if you can take them out, you may as well take them out if you haven't already. Just makes sense. It makes sense, people. It makes that sense. You know what I'm saying? So I just want to come this way. Let's ignore all these dudes and run down here. Run down here. Keep coming, ignore these ants. I'm sure these ants are evolving, you know. I'm pretty sure. I cannot remember these guys with the wings ever being down here. Probably just need to pay that much attention. I don't know. But they got wings now. I don't know if he's my pocket. Oh no, are they wasps? Oh, are they wasps? <laughs> I thought I thought they were ants. My bad. My bad. I'm an idiot. All right. You can leave a comment. Tell me I'm as well. It's all good. It's all good. So if I'm here, guys, you probably just won't kill him. It's up to you. I'm taking him out though. Bitch, as for your mate, as for your mate, where are you going? Okay, so you need to come down this way, guys. So you'll have to jump down here. Ignore that, you can get that if you want as well, but you have to go this way either way. So come down here, jump up here. And it will be like one of those big old dirty buses. You know the bus that's down here? I don't know if you've ever done it. Yeah, you know this Stell, which actually this weapon's named after. But there's a, the similar bus is right where we are now. There's one down there. You don't have to kill it. You can come this way either way. But yeah. Then guys, just want to gently walk down and step there. Don't jump. Don't jump and then just come across here. And the chest is right there. Boom. And that's it, guys. Open it up. You get this loot. It really is that simple, guys. Now, I'm just going to quickly go and check what that is up there. Because I haven't got that yet. And I obviously haven't been up here. Probably just going to be a rune, knowing my luck. Knowing my luck. Boom, boom. Oh, smithing stone, okay. And there we have it, guys. That's how you get this amazing weapon. 
Uh, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more, I don't think be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, people, I will see you on that next one.